So someone had the idea, woke up this morning and wanted to do what? Hang up our pictures. Hang up these pictures. <laughs> Hanging up pictures is so tough because our last pictures, good morning, baby. Yeah, Keisha had to help us do it. Um, it's tough. So, okay, so this is where, this is the tape we have going. So that's what we're doing. Okay, so what, we, what I also wanna do is I wanna make sure all of these are hung at the same height, but they also have to be the same distance. So I think we should decide on what distance we like and then put tape in between for the distance if that makes sense. So decide on the distance, measure out a piece of tape, cut out four strips, and then make sure. I think that's idea. Then we also have to make sure how much over do we want these pictures? Do we want the pictures to go all the way over here? I really think the tape is good because it really just shows where we want the pictures because we have this window right here. All right guys, so that's what we're working on today. Baby. Why are you putting handprints on my oven? No cares, man, no cares. Okay guys, so I wanted to give you an update on what was going on with our yard. Okay, so um, we still don't have grass. They have to come back and fix our grass right here. Um, and for those of you who are just joining, we had a $10,000 repair on our plumbing in our new home. Make sure you check out our last video to see. But they laid our concrete, which I was so happy with because, I don't know, this part seemed like it was going to perhaps take the longest. But concrete's looking good, or sidewalk. Luckily, it didn't impact this particular tree. We just need more grass. So I don't know what they're going to do about the grass situation because, I mean, what is it, sod? I'm not like a grass person, but it finally... You know, it doesn't look like patches anymore, a little bit, but the grass started finally growing in. So, I don't know. I guess we'll have a patch of just brand new grass. So yeah, so that's where we're at with that. And then here's the house. I don't know if you guys know we have a new, a new reef. I can't remember if that was in the last video. So yeah. So today is cleanup day. Um, we've been in the house. About a month now? What your shoes? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We've been in the house about a month now, so it's time for a deep cleaning. And I want to bring you guys back to what Sequina's doing. probably needing your help. Oh. Shady little thing today. So she's lining up the picture to the top of the... Sounds like, like she's like requesting for help, not asking, but requesting. So, uh, BRB. It's definitely our biggest fear. Like, this is the hardest, and I feel I can conquer it all. Oh, that means you're gonna have a honey do list. Okay, guys, this is the final. We actually hung up our photos. This is like the. <laughs> This is the most difficult thing. Every time we hang up photos, we absolutely do not like doing it because we don't want to mess up the wall. But I think we did a pretty awesome job. The living room is not complete yet for us to do a tour, but we wanted to give you just some glimpses of what we're up to. Okay, we also hung up this photo as well. Well, this picture. Um, Sequina wanted to go a little bit higher, but I kind of wanted it level with the um, door with the doors just because it was two of them right there. But now I don't know, but I think I kind of really like it the same height as the door. And that's just um, the door into the guest bedroom. And then this is them? our guest bath. Why don't you show them what you hung on the actual front door? Oh, I showed them. Oh. The, the wreath? Yeah. Yeah. And this is, that's just one of Harp's old uh, car seats. So we actually can't wait to show you guys some other things. Not in this video, but um, we have our couch now. 
um, which you guys saw a glimpse of. We have our eat-in table, our dining room table. The house for the most part is fully furnished. It's, um, we need some more items just to like fill out the house a bit. So some more pictures, we need nightstands. I bought lamps yesterday. Oh, do you guys wanna see the lamps I bought? Okay guys, so these are the lamps. These are the lamps the queen and actually, I actually agreed on because we typically never agree on you know anything um but this shade of lamp actually went well with because you can see just a little peek of the nightstand over there um and a little peek of a little peek of the uh what are those things called the hang from the window curtains there we go so wanted just more of a neutral palette you know, okay i'm going to show you sequina's nightstand i absolutely hate that she has her safe right there i need to find like a cute box or something to conceal it anyway so how cute is this lamp like it's really simple but and then you can kind of see a bit of the bed because you guys know we have to do a bed tour so i can't show you everything but really i wanted it to go with the bed and then with the curtains over here uh we do have watches and then we have to charge stuff the nightstand has a charger which is pretty cool but i want to get a charging stand for our apple watch and our phones so yeah yes baby Yes, you brought that up for mommy. Thank you. Can mommy have it? Thank you. So yeah, guys, I think it's um it's really cute. What do you think about the lamp, baby? Okay. So yeah, we still have a couple wire situation to figure out. So that's what you guys see. So of course, when we get everything figured out, we'll do a room tour. Thank you, baby. <clears throat> and of course, we have this big space right here um, that needs to be filled with something super exciting. Is that a book? What is that? That's cards. Thank you. You said what? My heart is racing. Why is your heart racing? Oh, I thought you got me again. How do you like the lamps? Again, I thought it was a red fedora up here. <laughs> so you don't like the lamps? You were so lamp, you were so anti lamp. I thought it was something for me. The lamps are for you. Don't the lamps like legit make it though? Yeah, the room looks more sophisticated. Sophisticated. Yes. Okay guys, mission accomplished. I told her that I needed to surprise her and that she had a surprise in the bedroom. I guess it was pretty bad because she thought she had like an actual surprise, but I thought the lamps were a good surprise. It's not. Does anyone else, else have a list like this? I have a to-do list with all of, just our frequently, um, the stores that we frequent and the things that we need from them. So today we're going to Home Depot. This is the kind of stuff we need from Home Depot. We have a couple holes that we had to patch up already. Yes, so we need putty. I need light bulbs because we brought the wrong ones for our um, formal dining room, the light in there. I need more rose gold bins to spray paint black. And I need flowers from Publix. Probably won't make it to Publix today. So, just curious if anyone else does this or if you guys know a better way to kind of uh, put all your lists, all your stores and lists in one place. Okay guys, so we just came back from Walmart. We got these two shelves that we actually wanna put up in the bathroom and in the guest bathroom. I also wanna put the same shelves in our bathroom as well, but we needed to test out a space first. My book was to test out our bedroom first, just in case we mess up, but um, Sequina didn't want to. I got more of these rose gold baskets for the pantry because I just need more baskets. And they got, Sequina likes, I mean Harper likes these um, mini pancakes and it's easy to do them, to make them for Harper in the morning. And some of this. I was like, that was like a cute little, that was like a quick little haul, huh? Um, we got some more items, but most most of it was just like stuff that goes upstairs. So, uh, yeah, that I don't know if we'll be putting up the shelves today, but I will definitely keep you guys posted. I may spray paint today, but we've been kind of cleaning up all morning, so I'm ready to just like relax. All right, y'all. I also got these hooks. I've been loving them. I've actually put them in random places. Well, not random, but I've been putting them in places um, in the kitchen and underneath our cabinets 
for our washcloths like here's some right here that I just put for the drying cloth and then this is the cloth to clean the stainless steel it's like a little messy because I was um cleaning earlier uh, and then where else oh I also have some hooks hook right here so Queen actually messed up one of my um oven mitts that's why I only have one and she has to buy me another one because she she caught herself trying to clean it but then she was bleaching it in a sink and I just don't I really don't understand what happened there so the reason why I wanted this one is to go here right here in the pantry to hang up our aprons um I really should use aprons more do you guys use aprons when you cook because I totally and completely mess up every single shirt that I'm wearing so why not just wear an apron when I cook duh so yeah um anyone wants to update on the pantry this is what we're looking like right now so you see I need some more baskets for this situation up here and then they're out of cereal that's why we got some more cereal so yeah, so we've been keeping it a bit clean, which I am pretty proud of. So that's the update on that. Who else's freezer looks like this? And I bought these knowing we didn't have any type of room. Like, where is this gonna go? Where are you gonna go? Anyone else is like lacking this freezer space right here? I was really trying all of these real good um, products for you guys. I do have a product link. Right there, right there. And then there's some enchiladas. So they got a whole, whole, whole lot of, um, of products. So I will definitely leave our link at the bottom so you can get a percentage off. But yeah, so I'm trying to figure out where this stuff gonna go. Yeah guys, so that's what we're looking like right here. We don't eat a lot of frozen food that often. That's why it's just like stuff. We'll eat frozen pizza every now and then, but yeah that's uh that's the compromise right there okay guys so here's where the aprons ended up being i don't think it looks it doesn't look horrible it looks very functional so i'm fine with it of course the queen has tie-dye apron and this is my apron i was actually gifted with and i did show it in one of our um cooking videos so yeah that was a that was a nice simple project guys that i was able to take care of look at that Hey cousins, so I know I haven't seen you guys much this vlog, but y'all see I have been working and doing my thing. So, um, you know, we got the uh, whole picture situation together. So that is like a lot off me right now. Like my shoulders feel much lighter. Hey, you dreaming about it? Huh? Were you dreaming about it? No, I just wanted, you know, some type of completion. So the next thing we have is these little things. Jamila bought them. Um, she actually bought two of them because she had a vision for our bathroom. Now she doesn't know where she wants them. So, yeah, stand by. So, Harper, say hey. Hey. Hey, hey cousins. Peekaboo. <laughs> yeah. All right, y'all. Later.